أني مسني الذر وأنت أرحم الراحمين أيوب A read-along storybook is waiting for you. Watch this video till the end and find out how to get it. Ayub was a prophet of Allah. His wife, Leia, was a loyal and hard-working woman who loved her husband a lot. They used to be so rich that if they wished, they could spend the day in one magnificent house and the night in another. Like Leia, their children were also beautiful and would charm all with their good manners. But one day, Allah decided to test Ayub with a disease. He got painful and ugly blisters all over his body, except for his heart and tongue, with which he remembered Allah. And not only that, all his children passed away. He had lost all his money and luxuries and was in great difficulty. Yet he thanked Allah for it. At least now, he could worship Allah without being disturbed. Their friends, relatives and neighbours couldn't bear to be around Ayub. Ugh, he is unbearable to look at. And the smell from his wounds is awful. I can barely stand near him. If Allah loved Ayub, he would not have given him such a horrible disease. So they placed him near a garbage dump outside the city, so they would not have to look at him. Ugh. But Leia knew that Allah tests those he loves. So she took great care of Ayub and helped him to eat by putting small morsels of soft food in his mouth. She washed his smelly, pus-stained clothes and cleaned his oozy blisters again and again. Every day, her legs ached and her hands smelled of ointments and pus. Yet she would go out in search of money to buy food for them. Finally, when she laid down at night, tears would flow from her eyes as she remembered the warmth of her babies. But Ayub and Leia did not let their despair overtake them. Instead, they kept praying and thanking Allah for the past 70 amazing years of their life. For 18 years, they did not complain to Allah even once. Then, one day, Ayub decided to make a dua to Allah for his pain. O Allah, I am in pain and you are very merciful. Allah loved this dua, for with it, Ayub did not complain. He praised Allah. Allah saw how patient Leia and Ayub were and ended their test. One day when Leia was away, Allah told Ayub to strike his foot on the ground. Ayub did as he was told. A spring of fresh, sparkly water started to gush out of the ground. Ayub drank from the spring and bathed in it. His skin became smooth and clear. Then an angel gave Ayub a dress from heaven to wear. He looked younger and more handsome than ever before. Ayub had passed the test and it was now time to receive his reward. When Leia returned, she was amazed to see a handsome man wearing rich, ornate clothes. Oh, have you seen the sick man who was lying here? Said Leia. It is I, Ayub, said Ayub. Don't joke around, young man. 
I am tired and worried for my old, sick husband, said Leia. Look at me. I'm not joking. It is Ayub, said Ayub. Oh, Allah, you are the most merciful and kind, said Leia. Allah made Leia young and pretty again too. He also gave them more children. Soon, even their wealth was returned to them. Leia and Ayub's patience and gratefulness brought them heavenly life in this world and the next. We have a printable read-along book just for you. You can win this free gift in three simple steps. Number one, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Number two, like this video. And number three, message us on WhatsApp. The link to our WhatsApp is in the description below.